Hey guys, well, I'm in the middle of stippling a pea mag, and I, uh, I got bored. So I figured I would, uh, go over some of the stuff I just went and got today. Um, first thing, first thing first, I went and I picked up some more Ear Pros from, uh, Surefire. And of course, the obvious, the Ear Pro, it stands for Ear Protection. I, I see a lot of people, for some reason, they get all upset. When somebody says "I Pro" and "Ear Pro," they're like, "Why does everybody gotta act like they're an operator?" Well, no, it's, it's "Pro" stands for protection. Why have to say the whole damn word when you can just say "Ear Pro," "I Pro"? Why have to say "Eye Protection," "Ear Protection"? So, I went and got that. <clears throat> that wasn't bad. That was twelve ninety-five. I mean, a little expensive, but whatever. I've picked up for the uh, M&P forty. New Safari, uh, the Safari Land, not new Safari Land, but it, well, it is a brand new, it is new, but, <clears throat> yeah, let me get this shit out of here. Um, this is the one with the felt liner. I think Pete from the Army Channel did a, uh, did a review on this. It's got the thumb, thumb brake release. I'll grab the M&P right here and throw it in there. You know, it fits perfectly. Uh, you know, locks it in there. As you as you grab the firearm, you know your your thumb literally naturally pushes that down and it just comes right out, you know. <clears throat> so there we go. It took me a second. I finally got it out of there. <clears throat> so this comes with the paddle. It also comes with uh, let's see here, belt, some kind of belt loop, canted. This was thirty nine ninety five, where I got it. Uh, then they had oh, this place had everything, man. They had uh, uh, cases of fifteen round uh, AR magazines. Uh, they had uh, I went and picked up two more M and P forty magazines. I got these bad boys for uh, twenty eight ninety five a piece. Um, that one fly. But these are the 15 rounds, just like the ones that mine came with. So. But, and of course, the magazine disconnector. As you can see, it's just like the ones that mine came with. It says 4357. Same exact thing. Except for, oh, you know what is different? Oh, no, never mind. Okay. Yeah, it says 14 on this side. It's odd, odd and even. Okay. Yeah, but same exact magazine. Got two of those. All right, and then I got a uh, hundred rounds of forty that I'm just gonna put in my little safe there. This is gonna be ammo that I'm not gonna. Sh I was gonna buy. They had a, they had five hundred rounds for one hundred and forty seven ninety nine. It was fourteen fourteen. I'm sorry, one hundred and forty nine ninety nine for five hundred rounds. It was fourteen ninety nine if you bought five hundred rounds per box. It was sixteen ninety nine if you bought less than five hundred rounds per box. So I I ended up just getting two boxes for right now. Um, I I I don't know. I I'm I'm sitting there and I'm kind of like shit. I might I might end up going back. I honestly might end up going back there today and grabbing a uh, cake. You know, five hundred rounds for one hundred and forty nine ninety nine. You can't beat that. But that's what I got today, guys, at the gun store, my local gun store. Um, you know, try to support the local guys. This, this, this shop that I go to, they, they've got, they, you know, what do I, how many mags do I have now? Five? There ain't no, uh, there are no, no danger of, they do mostly police officers. Yeah, so now I have the five magazines for my M&P 40, which is what I like to keep on hand is five, basically, for a, a pistol, even though I've got like 12 <laughs> Glock 21 magazines. That's because I have the Chris Vector. So, um, so now I've got five magazines, which I'll probably end up getting more. Um, who, who knows? Uh, who knows? I definitely want to get the uh, the the uh, the uh, C compact version with a smaller uh, smaller grip and everything like that. Smaller. I want to get that because. Uh, that, I think, is what I'm going to use as a CCW when I get my out-of-state concealed carry. Alright, guys, that's it. Thank you very much for uh, watching. 
and have a good one. Remember, support your local gun shops. Let me tell you, something I've noticed about my local gun shops is every time I go online to look for ammo, these freaking people want like $1,000 for 1,000 rounds of 5.56 five, or... They just want absolutely ludicrous prices for ammo and this and that. When I go to my local gun shops, yes, they might not have the ammo I want all the time as of late. But guess what? My local gun shops here in Jersey, guys, they're not charging an arm and a leg for this ammo. So, I mean, I'm, I'm happier than a pig and shit with that. So, I mean, I, I just spent $16.99 a box for 550 rounds. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, it's not good, but it's not bad. I mean, if I would have bought 500 rounds, it would have been $14.99 a box of 50 rounds. Do the math, you know? All right, guys. Thank you. Have a good one.